have lunch right now. I know. I, <laughs> I just <laughs> did. So. Did you? Did you? Yeah, I totally ate. Yeah. Our, our schedules, breakfast is so super early. Lunch is like at 9. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. It is time now for the morning mix. And happy Friday. All right. Have you ever returned clothes that you really only bought to wear once? Well, some people say... You should be punished. Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, a new study by one poll found that 46% of people surveyed believe the act known as wardrobing, oh, there's a name to it, should mm -hmm. be considered a serious illegal offense. Now, it may seem like a harmless way to save some cash, but research shows less than half of all return goods can be resold by companies at full price. Acts of return fraud cost retailers $12.6 billion. Oh. Dollars. Okay, two questions. One. Yeah. Oh. Have you ever done it? Have you guys you know, ever purchased I've, like, something? I've bought something it? on Amazon, tried it on, but I didn't wear it out. Yeah. You know, not to the same extent. <laughs> I think we're guilty. Raise your hand, Jocelyn. No, no, no. I feel like I've bought stuff and then I wear it. I don't like it. And then, yeah, yeah I return it. I don't like it. But you wore it. Maybe. A few, you know what? <laughs> I'm putting myself on the spot yes, here. You put yourself have on you done it? Wait, have you, you know, done I, it? I have not. Um, I purchased a dress once. It was a designer dress mm -hmm. that I loved and I couldn't afford it. So I had a dressmaker make a version of it and That's then I returned cool. the dress back. Wow. So I saved like 500 bucks. So. Okay. I mean, there's that. Anyway, the fashion industry, we should work on how we can do better. Okay. I don't do this like often. Maybe good, like good. Same <laughs> All right, something else coming up in October, Halloween. It's just about a month away, but it's never too early to get into that spooky spirit. And this year, it looks like kids aren't the only ones who will be getting in on the fun. The pet service WAG says 59% of pet parents, well, they plan to take their furry friends trick-or-treating this year. In fact, the survey showed that pets are actually the preferred family member to celebrate Halloween with. Who knew? I'm guessing that's because they won't steal all the best candy. Well, that makes sense. 53% of respondents even said pet costumes are cuter than other costumes. Well, this makes cute. sense, though, because since COVID, there's a really common phrase. It's pets are the new kids and, and plants are the new pets. Mm. <laughs> and so it makes sense that people are taking their pets out for yeah. trick-or-treating. They still want to experience it. Maybe they just don't want to, I don't know, take the next step and have yeah. some of their own. They have some of their own, maybe. Yeah, I haven't taken my dog out trick-or-treating. Maybe, yeah. maybe this year. Yeah, we dress them up, though. You know, put cute I, little sweaters on. I definitely on dress them with that. Yeah. I dress my kids up. Kids, dogs, it's all, you know, we take them all out for <laughs> trick-or-treating. Mm -hmm. The whole the family photos. comes, the yes. whole family. Let's talk a little Golden State yes. Warriors. Yeah, they start training camp tomorrow. Can you believe wow. it already? Wow. The whole squad is healthy. They're happy about that and ready for another big year. Fingers crossed. There might be uh, not anyone any, anyone more excited than this guy right here. Of course, we're talking about Clay Thompson. This will be his first chance to play a full season since he was injured in the 2019 finals. Coach Kerr says he's in great shape. He's a good place mentally and spiritually, and we're going to continue to hope it's nothing but smooth sailing for the dubs from here on out. So... I, look at what Clay. is this video? <laughs> I'm confused. I, I love enjoying Clay. life. He's just enjoying yes. life. He's getting yeah. himself ready and hyped up for the season, and it's kind yeah. of In his a vibe. Yeah. Okay. yeah, it is. Like Are you guys it. ready? Are you ready for yeah. some for some hoops? Oh yes. yes. And the fact that he this is the first time he's healthy going into a season yeah. in a few years. It's been a minute. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited to see Steph Curry come. I'm excited for everyone to come back and make a run for another NBA championship. I know that's going to be a very very exciting year, yes. and we will all be watching, of, of course. course. So yes. go Warriors.